Quilters Newsletter Machine Quilting Tips and Techniques is brought to you by Bernina, Made to Create, and Benartex, Fabric for Quilters by Quilters. Hi, I'm Connie Fanders, and this is Quilters Newsletter Machine Quilting Tips and Techniques with Bernina. And today we are going to talk about applique. And applique has been around for many, many years. And we see it a lot in quilts and quilted projects. And we are definitely seeing a resurgence of applique on more than just quilt projects. As you see here, I've put it onto the little adorable elephants. So applique is a technique that has many, many places that it can be used. So let's just cover the basics of applique. First of all, to applique, I like to use a product called Fuse and Fix. And this is a product that is fusible on one side. And if you flip it over, you can peel off the backing and it's sticky back. So then you can stick it to your background fabric. So to begin, I am just going to do a simple heart shape. And I have simply drawn a heart on the paper side of the Fuse and Fix. And I have fused my fabric to the fusible side of the Fuse and Fix. Then I cut out my heart shape to be what I have here. So now I'm going to peel the paper off the back and stick it onto my backing fabric into the desired position. Now I'm ready to go to my sewing machine. And the foot that I'm going to use on my Bernina machine is the number 20 foot. And this is the open toe embroidery foot. And what's so beautiful about this foot, it is, just like the name calls it, an open toe foot. So I am going to be able to see exactly where I want to stitch as I'm applicating. And now it's time to select a stitch for my applique. And to applique, you have a lot of choices of different stitches that you can use. And what I'm going to work with today is just the blanket stitch. So I'm going to select the blanket stitch. And you can see here it is now selected on my screen. The next thing I'm going to do is move it over way to the right position so that when I sew, it is going to stitch right along the inner toe of my presser foot. Another thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to engage my needle stop down. We will be doing a lot of pivoting and turning while we're appliquing, and so it's very handy to have that needle stop down every time I stop sewing. So I have my fabric in place, and I'm ready to begin appliquing. The shape that I have chosen to applique is a heart shape. And if you're a beginner at applique, this is a wonderful shape to practice on because on a heart you do have an outside corner, an inside corner, and curves that you can practice on. So when you get to your quilt project, you'll be a pro. So I'm going to lower my foot. And as I said earlier, I'm going to make sure that the inside toe of my foot runs right along the edge of my applique fabric. And the blanket stitch is just going to take a bite into my applique. Now as you get to the curve, you want to occasionally stop and pivot the fabric. And when you stop, you want to make sure that your needle stops on the outside swing. So it is on the outside of the applique. So now again, I'm going to take a stitch. It's going to take a bite in. And then I'm going to stop. My foot will automatically raise for me on this machine. And then I can pivot and continue to sew. And then pivot as needed as you continue around that curve. Now I'm getting to the point where I'm at the inside 
point, and what I'm going to do again is stop with my needle on the outside swing. I'm going to pivot or around the corner, and then I continue to sew around my curve. As we approach the corner, the outside corner, we're going to stitch slowly. And again, we're going to end with the needle in the fabric on the outside swing. So then I can pivot a nice square corner and continue to sew. When you get to the end, you want to secure it with a knot. And on the Bernina 750, we have a thread cutter. When you push the thread cutter, it'll automatically secure your thread, cut the thread, and raise the foot for you. So there you have it. Our heart is complete. So now you can go home and applique to your heart's desire. Quilter's Newsletter Machine Quilting Tips and Techniques is brought to you by Bernina, Made to Create, and Benartex, Fabric for Quilters by Quilters. <laughs>